Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Carlo. In this video, I'm going to show you three things. First is how to earn in three ways in Axie Infinity Origin. And second is how much do I earn in the last season, season 0 of Axie Infinity Origin. And the third is my uh, rank finish for the season 0. And we know that uh, season 1 is on the way. I think that's uh, September, September 14. So better watch out. So let's go! First is how can we still earn in Axie Infinity Origins? So good question. There are three ways. So first is still the number one, the old way, the SLP. How much SLP do I earn this? This much! <coughs> Zero SLP. In fact, and I, I spent around 8, 8, 10 or 12,000 SLP. I don't know, in crafting. So, se so we're going to the second one. Second one is crafting. So crafting, you can in Axie Infinity Origin. For those of people that knew or uh, returning to Axie Infinity, this is the uh, new way that we can earn because we can uh, craft certain runes and charms, NFT runes and charms that we can sell it to, through the marketplace. Here are my uh, runes and charms that I'm able to craft that has values. I uh, There's an 8, so here it is. I'm going to show you. That are the 8, so here are the Ethereum price of it. So all of them, I managed to sell them and um, able to gain 0.19 ethereum if we're going to convert that to peso that will be almost or 90,000 plus bhp philippine peso so it's a good amount of money if you're just playing right so how do we get that no we need slp to burn and the moon shard that we get in the game so that's why I say that I uh, spent 10 to 12,000 SLP. I'm not, I'm not sure how exactly I spent, but I managed to burn that and lucky enough to able to get this uh, uh, runes and charms. But in the second way to earn, this is pure luck. Yeah, uh, when, you're, when your level is uh, going up, uh, your uh, chance to have a mystic or epic rune charms is much more higher but still it's based on luck so if you're not lucky it's not for you i just lucky to have those <clears throat> so the most expensive rune that was sell last season is the heart of the ocean that's the uh, uh, aqua mystic rune that was bought and sell around 1.1 ethereum that's a lot of damage 1.1 ethereum so that time i think the ethereum is around 80 85,000 bhp so imagine that almost 100,000 uh profit for the guy that sell the able to craft the heart of the ocean and sell it to the marketplace right so that's good money <laughs> so that that's the uh that's a way new way to earn in axi infinity so if you're going to calculate the uh, the one that I able to earn, so I managed to earn 19,000 PHP. That's 0.19 wet, around 0.19 wet, and then minus the transaction fee because if we're going to mint it, there's a three USD in a equivalent uh, per rune per charm. So let's say that's around 1,400, 500 uh, peso now for eight charms or and runes, and uh, and I uh, spent. Let's say 3,000 peso for my uh, own, for my needed runes and charms. I bought a uh, healing rune, one healing rune, and a leafy pot charm, and HP charms for the plant. So let's say I managed to spend 3,000 peso for that. So let and for the, yeah, we know that I, I keep on playing Axie, so I'm able to earn or hold uh, SLP. So let's just say that I spent 10,000 K, uh, 10,000 SLP. So that around 2,200 PHP. So my profit is still around 13,000 for the whole season. And that that season, season zero, is only one month. So that's good if you're just playing, right? Because <laughs> I rather play a game that I have a uh, chance to earn than nothing. So before I keep playing uh, MMORPG, MOBA, shooting games, grinding. I just love playing but in the end I don't have no no return for me but in the Axie I, I enjoy playing and then 
there's a chance that you can learn. Hi. Okay. So yeah, that, that's the second way that you can learn here in Axie Infinity Origins. So the third is the going to the third, and the third is the the rewards, the season end rewards. So yeah, we, we managed to climb all the way to uh, top 86, but yeah. <laughs> in time, we're just been beaten down by the guys that really invested in the game. They have a pretty good charms and runes, so I have loose streak. And that the end of the season, I just end around 500 plus. So I'm 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 in that range. So that will be eight point something AXS. So not bad. So that's the third uh, way that you can earn. So SLP, but now. We use SLP for craft, but you can still, if you don't want to craft, <laughs> you can you can uh, mint that after 30 days. But there's no use. SLP is still now for crafting. And second is the runes and charms that you can get through the craft. And the third is the season end reward. So for me, I think my uh, profit of profit minus the expenses that I... Uh, around uh, 20,000 PHP for the last uh, season series. So that's all guys. Thank you for viewing. Please follow, follow me on Twitter and my YouTube and on my Facebook. You guys are awesome. Thank you for uh, supporting me on this channel. I, I'm amazed that I managed to reach 3,000 uh, subscribers in my channel. So thank you, thank you guys. And uh, hopefully see you in the next video. And 